Country Elk Trip 2022. First leg of the trip in is done. Father and son here. Last time Micah was up <coughs> was 2016. And this year we're trying to get Seth his first elk ever. All right, so this is Fisher's first time in the back country as well. And we're gonna see what we can do. He's already shot a bull, so he's not first on the list for sure. But just coming back in the back country uh, with us. We did yeah. good. Yeah, I think we did really well. Just under two hours. Yep. <sighs> time to get rolling. We got a few more miles to go and then we'll be at camp. Thanks for watching the channel. Please subscribe and like our videos for more action. Safe and sound and it is beautiful, beautiful day. Absolutely phenomenal day. And thank the Lord we really had no issues. We do thank you for a good safe trip in and the beautiful, wonderful weather and your creation. Plus food as we eat. Help us to get camp set up in timely fashion. I've got yellow curry. Yellow curry and yellow curry and Carl. Uh, hey, first morning, I wake up and there's a bull looking down at our camp. So, um, I just got done telling Carl, don't let your coffee boil over, because it makes a mess. And I was telling Carl's story, and the top, <laughs> blew, up like the the top blew off of here, <laughs> and we had coffee grounds going everywhere. First evening, we're looking for elk, and came to the top of this ridge to check it out. We got a bull bugling over in this bowl right here. So we're gonna try to see what we can find. Get the horses tied up up here and sneak over the top, see what's up. Right behind the front shoulder, buddy. Just squeeze. Just squeeze. You hit him.
So as we're sitting here, Fisher uh, created a small version of where we're at with the mountain range. Let's see what you got, buddy. So this is where we are here. That's where we're at, okay. And this is where the bull's at, where this is. The bull's at, yeah. And this is the next ridge, and that's the next ridge. And so where are we going now? Uh, back over here. No. We have to get the horses. We're gonna get the horse, okay, yes. We're going over there to get the horses. Where are we gonna go? Yep, we're going up to that way. Elk are right here. And we want to get over on this ridge to be able to look into here, in, into the elk. We think the big one fell right in here. But there's some other three by threes in there that Mike might be able to get a shot at. So that's what we're hoping. We think the other ones took off. So we're gonna get, we gotta get down and across it's pretty steep right here. Carl is gonna wait up here. I don't know if you can see him. He's he's right in here somewhere. There he is. He's moving right right behind those trees. Um, but anyway, he's gonna wait there in case that bull isn't dead and moves, so we can see where he goes. There's Carl. He's watching us. We made it to the bottom. It's pretty steep. Big old bull, look at that stud. Oh man. He's going. <laughs> Who we know? He's over here, Mike. He's right over here. Made it back to the horses. That was a long ways up there. And sometimes, sometimes, even though we were going for a second one, sometimes you're glad you didn't get one. <laughs> <laughs> Amen to that, brother. <laughs> Oh, Here we go. Right. There you go. Come on, get it up. It. There you go. <laughs> Carl's got to give a hand. Dude, what'd you think of that? That was the coolest thing ever. He's so big. All right, day three of, uh, actually day two of full days of hunting. Day three that we've been in here, we hunted a little bit the first day. Uh, and so we've actually saw two bears this morning. Uh, the one was, couldn't get on camera, but the other one got it on camera. Uh, but you know what, we're gonna have a word of prayer as we get moving. You wanna pray for us this morning? Yeah. All right. Heavenly Father, we thank you. See. Found some elk up here in his bowl. Let's see if we can find them here. Are they on the first ridge? No. There's a cow. A cow. 
cow, 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 cow. Fisher found him a little piece. Big, big bull fighting. I don't know. <laughs> well, it's chilly here. Um, we have uh, we spotted a good bit of elk. Um, I've been watching this herd up in this bowl. There's a spike and two cows in this picture. And if I go just up from him, the bull is sitting right there. You smoked him. Hit him again. Hit him again. You smoked him. You smoked him. Yep, hit him again. Yes. You got him. <laughs> and it was what? 3.59? 33 seconds or something like that. I looked oh. at my watch. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Bam! <sighs> what do you think, Seth? That's so cool. Isn't that awesome? Yes. Isn't that so awesome? And look at this scenery we get to look at the whole time. Holy smokes. Something knocked down one part of our fence last night. Hoping he got zapped. 
It looks like at least the heads are there. We'll see. We'll see if he got got more than that here in a second. A bear came through. And I don't know if the fence didn't work or what, but he got in here and really laid down this fence. Hope it's not broke. Hope we can still use it. But uh, he got two of our quarters. Well, there's one right there, one quarter. Actually, a lot of it's still there. There's still a whole bunch in there. And it would still be good. Well, he hasn't bit that. The other one. At least he could clean up after himself. We picked out four cows way the heck over there. Um, they're cows, so we're not even going to touch them, obviously. But um, it is windy on the other side of the rock. Holy smokes! As is typical up here, it, it, it tends to be really, really windy up at this spot. And so I glassed as much as I could over there. I didn't see anything. And uh, so now I'm gonna glass this side, see if I can pick out a couple of elk in the, in the trees. And I got the guys with me here. All right, guys? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Micah. Micah ended up going, taking a little walk on a trail up uh, up in a basin here that we caught a couple of bulls on so years ago. Um, and so he's gonna, he went to check that out and see what happens there. All right, we're up here, way on the top. And we found elk across the valley from us. Once again, you can see that elk right there, it's a spike. Another one. Come down just there. Right down just in there. I can't find it right now, but there's another one right there. 600 yards right now. Well, I'm trying to get that elk, and then sure enough, we've got a grizz right here. Yeah, it's a grizz. He's huge. Yeah, it's a big grizz. So then you see it? He's giant. All right, well, we're sitting here and we look up and I spotted some elk, some bulls, clear over on this ridge over here. There's one, right there, there's another one right there. So we are going to try to get, off, get over there and quickly see what we can do. Might be a challenge. We gave a hearty effort on this last day to get on these bulls and fill Fisher's tag. Unfortunately, the stars did not align. Although disappointed, we were grateful for the father and son tags that were filled and the experiences we enjoyed in the days prior. We always long for the next adventure. <laughs>